What is up, YouTube, and welcome to, I believe it's episode 15 of the Crownless Ice Walkthrough. Uh, today, we will be going not into the Vault of Ice. We will be going down here um, to the Emperor's Retreat. So we should definitely be hitting level 20 today, which is super exciting. That means I'll get Grizzleheim. Um, so yeah, let's, uh, let's go ahead and get into this. And of course, once we hit Grizzleheim, we have... Um, couch potato farm and stuff like that um it is double reagents right now so we're gonna be picking up definitely every reagent we see once i hit level 20 i'm probably gonna do side quests get a little bit more money um and do a lot of stuff in grizzleheim and uh, if i do side quests i probably won't post them on the playlist for my crownless walkthrough but i'll probably post them to my youtube channel just like highlights and whatever so let's go ahead and talk to shalik just as i expected this place is heavily guarded. Manders toil while Krokotep relaxes in his chamber. Krokotep is known for his intricate defenses. You will find two guardians at the first gate, both princes of the Sakwi family. Even with balance, I would not stand a chance at my age. Please, fight bravely to defeat them, and return to me safely. What's up, man? How, how you doing today? Alright, so let's go ahead and get to Prince Sutton. Let me make sure I have the right deck equipped once we get there. I always, always go in with the wrong deck on my other wizards. Let's see. All right, so we do have the right one equipped. Let's go ahead and walk in. I had hoped to face a mighty warrior to test my skills, but you showed up instead. Hardly worth the efforts of a prince. Wow, all right, kind of rude. These are both ice, so... Definitely need to have some more ice traps in here. And we do have our monsters as packed. All right, let's go ahead and go in. All right, let's see. So we're probably not gonna need this. Let's go ahead and draw the monstrous, put it on that, and we'll go ahead and shield up a little bit. Alright, let's see. Um Let me get rid of that. We have another evil snowman. So we'll go ahead and enchant this one as well. That should be for both of them. So this one will probably definitely kill that one. Uh, let's go ahead and shoot up one more time. Just so we're a little bit in advance. Okay, um, go ahead and knock off that tower shield. And then we should be able to kill, possibly be able to kill him. Let's see, 399. It'll be close. Uh, I might follow it up with a ghoul. It'll give us a little bit of health back. And then we'll be able to go ahead and get the trap for the next one. Hopefully this will kill. Alright, so it didn't. How much health did he have left? 33? Okay, that's nothing serious. Let's go ahead and get rid of one of those. Let's go ahead and lightning bat. 
I'm gonna try not to use anything but a wand shot on him. If I can. <laughs> Might be able to do that. Alright, so we, so we got the lightning bat off. Let's see. Get rid of one of those. Hopefully it'll come up decently soon. Alright, we should at least get the ice. Nope, we did not even get that. Alright. Um... So this is what I'm gonna do. I might even well, I don't know, he has that He has a really big or he should have a big resist. Possibly not though. Alright, there's what I was looking for for him. Let's go ahead and kill that one. And then we'll we'll just go ahead and evil snowman him. Um, and then with that, we'll be able to ghoul right after, and it should kill him. <laughs> or we're gonna heal, because I waited too long. Probably gonna heal, because I waited too long. See, he has one pip. Oh, evil snowman. I don't even think, even if he, um, even if he was to attack, I don't think he could, I don't think he could have killed me. Alright, and then a ghoul should kill him. Or two ghouls will kill him. Oh, now, now we get the prism. Alright, we're definitely good then. Sweet, we didn't fizzle, so this will put us right out of range for him to kill us with anything. And we can just use another ghoul after that. I started eight minutes ago. I fizzled that. Alright, this one should kill him. Yeah. Alright, too easy. Too easy. Tested by a mere student wizard. Oh, the shame I have brought to my family Let's see. name. Still don't need any boots. Alright, and I will be right back whenever I get to Prince Kebby. Alright, and I am here, so let's go ahead and get into this. They sent you to confront me. You're not fit to clean the floors. Wow. Wow, okay. Um, let's put it in a third one, so maybe we'll get the ice prism a little bit earlier this time. I'm not gonna need any of those. So I should hopefully unclog the deck a little bit. All right, sweet, so we got one off the start. Okay, let me go ahead and get rid of this. We'll draw that card. Put that on him. <laughs> With a ghoul? <laughs> I kind of want to get the uh, one in a million badge on one of my wizards. I just haven't like looked into getting it like doing all the stuff you got to do to get the uh like correct cards and like tcs and all of that all 
All right, if I did that right, he should die next round. Oh, you are lying to me. You are lying to me. Oh, no. That hurts. That hurts so much. Ouch. Alright. This has been a horrible day. My entire day was ruined by that. Guess we'll just throw another one on. I probably won't enchant that snowman. I don't think I'm gonna need to. I should get a I should get a big enough boost from it being fire. If not, I can just follow it up with a one shot. So let's see. I want that. Let's go ahead and shield. I can never, like, remember if it's better to kill the boss first, or kill the minion, or if it's kill the boss unless it's the storm minion, then kill the storm minion because they're going to do a stupid amount of damage for no reason. I'm thinking this is gonna kill him. Yeah, Chick fil A nuggets are the absolute truth, not gonna lie. Didn't kill him. Alright. But we do have enough for ghoul, so we'll go ahead and get some of that health back right quick. And then probably save up for a heal, because we're gonna be getting kinda low soon. I still have to decide if I hit level 20, if I want to get stuff that gives me more health or keep getting more resist, since ice already has a lot of health, and that universal resist is kind of nice. Alright, let's see. Don't need that for right now. Um... I don't think I'm going to have to enchant a snowman for this. What kind of deck would you get uh, uh, the uh, jungle juice one? Let's see. Um... Let me just go ahead and heal, that way I don't have to worry about it later. Alright, you're not too worried about that tower shield. I still have, I think, one more one shot. So I should definitely be fine right right there. Yeah, I did, I only went through, I think it was the, uh, the balance decathlon. I did it once, and, um, I just, like, I didn't really feel like doing it again after that. But I really want to do the death one. Alright, probably a good thing that we healed then. Let's see. We put the trap on him. I get a power... Well, no, I can't attack him even though I get a power pip right here. Um... Let's go with one shot. Get rid of that. And then probably evil snowman lightning bat. Or lightning bat if it hits high end. I don't know. I guess it really doesn't matter to be honest. A power pip would be clutching here though. Okay. This game hates me. So let's see. Let's throw the lightning bat at him. And then we'll prism evil snowman. Sweet. We're two for two on lightning bats today too.
Oh, he only has 74. All right, we'll just cool then. And unless he puts on a tower shield, we got him. All right, please don't fizzle. Sweet, we didn't fizzle. All right. Easy clap once again. All right, I'll be right back whenever I get to Shalik. All right, now I'm back at Shalik. You've done well, young wizard. The lever should work now. Open the door and I'll meet you up ahead at the lake. All right, let's go ahead and open this door. All right, now I'm back at Shalik. Excellent. You've made it. Oh, my heart. This place is filled with enslaved manders. Krokotep knows I can't stand to see them suffer, but he does not know that you're on my side. Let's free the manders from their bondage. If we can do this, surely they will fight alongside us. I am ready to teach you new abilities right, to Diego, we are, prowess in magical duels. We are not worried about Speak that one, buddy. When you are ready. That'll be for side quest Sunday. The only thing I really know about Mirage so far um, is just like where I farm the couch potatoes at. Go ahead and get back to Shalik. We've done it, but we need to ensure that they are not enslaved again. Now we must deal with the overseer, Paniwi. Don't think me foolish for not rushing at once to get the Krakonomicon. If we do not save the Manders, we are no better than the Tuts. But I see no harm in hurrying. Defeat Overseer Paniwi and return to me at once. Just don't lose, Forehead. Best way to do it. Okay, I think we gotta turn these red. Yeah, because the seal's frozen. I'm kind of excited to try it. I probably won't do it on stream today, but I'll probably try it once I'm finished streaming. I think I'm gonna play on my uh, on my uh, Myth Wizard after I'm finished with this. All right, so we've unfrozen the door. And oh, he's in the back over here, right? Okay. He's ice once again. I should still have enough mod. Okay, I have four more monsters. You fail to see just how outmatched you are, wizard. All right. Well, should be pretty easy. Oh yeah, you uh, you uh, showed it to me yesterday. Let's go ahead and get that on him. Yeah, you showed me like three of your character stitches yesterday. Whenever I hop on my uh, on my uh, Myth Wizard, I'll, I'll, I'll check it out. All right, let's see. Um, so that's lightning bits. Get rid of one of those. Let's go and hit him with the lightning bits. Oh no. Alright, well, that happens. Uh, let's try it again. 
Alright. Knew it wasn't gonna fizzle a second time. Alright, so he should be... He's in range of a ghoul. So let's go ahead and ghoul. We'll have two pips. Let me get rid of one of those. I probably shouldn't have done that, but... Alright, ghoul, he'll be gone. And then we can one shot and get the other one out the way. Okay, um, get that going. Get this on, and we definitely have to get that wand shot to get the uh, tower shield out the way. Or actually, I could always just ghoul the uh, tower shield off if we don't get it quick enough. I think I'm actually just going to go ahead and do that. That'll get that out the way, and it will still have enough to use Evil Snowman. Alright, man, see you later. Oh, that wasn't a lot of health, but it'll help out a little bit. I was really afraid he was going to put on a minus 25 right there. Alright, so this Evil Snowman won't kill him. Rid of one of those. We're not gonna need all of those. But I think another ghoul after will kill him though. So. Yeah, another ghoul definitely will kill him after. Alright. Why did it use oh I only had okay, never mind. Go ahead and hit him with this and then the ghoul. Quite possibly the easiest battle yet, if I'm gonna be honest here. They always they're like dying cast is always evil snowman on me. Thirty-one, huh? Let's get rid of those, just in case we fizzle this. That way it'll definitely pop back up, but we didn't, so we're good. Let's use our teleporter around here to get the Shalik. No, alright. So I'll be right back whenever I get the Shalik. Alright, now I'm back at Shalik. Excellent job, young wizard. You've shown the Manders we mean to defeat the Tuts, and they are ready to join the fight. Krakotep cowers behind a door sealed by a combination. The Manders we freed tell me you must vanquish the Sakwi Keymaster to get it. Once you've defeated the Keymaster, the combination will appear in his room. Use that combination to open the door and take a vengeance on Krakotep. Alright, now we'll be right back whenever I get to the Sakwi Keymaster. Alright, now I'm at the Sakwi Keymaster. Are you the gatekeeper? I must put you to the ultimate test. Same strategy as usual, we'll just absolutely destroy him. Alright, let's see. Um Oh, we're starting off good. Okay. Um let's get rid of one of those. Draw that. And we'll put that on.
All right, um, let's get rid of that. I probably shouldn't have done that, but we'll go ahead and put that on after. And then we'll just tower shield until we get Evil Snowman. And a one shot now. Or I could set up on him, attack the minion, get that out the way. That way the minion won't tower shield him. That might actually be the better play. Let's check this out. I'm going to go ahead and do this. Because I don't really care about that pet stuff. So any little bit of extra damage will help. Might have actually would have been better to uh, just use that on him. Nice, what a solid 32 damage. Alright, um, alright, so now we have an evil snowman. So all we need to do now is get, uh, get a wand shot up. And we should be able to kill him. Or get very close to killing him, at least. Nothing that if we follow it up, the ghoul won't, won't kill him for sure. Alright, sweet. There's our wand shot. Go ahead and take him out. And that should... Okay. So we'll actually... If we get hit, we'll be able to heal right after if we need to. And I'm thinking this will kill him or get very close to killing him. Let's see. I still can't tell whenever ice fizzles. I keep watching to see if I can figure it out, but I just can't. Alright, so it didn't kill him, but it got close. Okay, um, let's get rid of this and that. And that, and let's hit him with this. Cause that'll get him within range for our, um, our evil snowman for sure. And then we should have a wand shot coming up soon. Yeah, sweet. There's the wand shot, and then the evil snowman should kill. And we'll have an evil snowman right here. Alright, and that should be it for this battle. Okay. New spell, wasn't expecting this. Wow. Alright, that was a lot. That was a lot more damage than I thought than I thought it was gonna be. Okay. So I definitely need to make sure I have at least like 350 health. Snake tree or croc snake tree, right? Yeah, we'll go croc snake tree. All right, I'll be right back whenever I get to croc tip. All right, and we are back, so let's go ahead and put in the combination. Croc snake. Pick up this before I forget. There's another one too, and then tree. 
right? You guys. Okay, and let's continue on. Should be right here, right? Yep. Don't provoke me, wizard. I was just thinking about letting you live in my service, of course. All right, well, let's see. We still have two more monsters, and I think that's all we have. Yes, so... I could also go ahead and add this evil snowman that I'd already made and we didn't use. Um, ooh, actually, let me add two of these. I want to use an ice wyvern. Let's see if we can go ahead and kill Crocotep with an ice wyvern. That'd be pretty cool. I'm right, that should be the next spell after Blizzard that, that I get. Sweet, and we got the ice, Wyver ice wyvern to start off with. All right, let's go ahead and put this ice prism on him. And we'll get that out the way. Um, I'll just stun him just because I can. Take that, you loser. I really thought he was about to put a tower shield on himself. I was about to be so mad. Alright, and we still haven't gotten the ice trap, but that's going to be okay. Let's go ahead and ice wyvern. This won't kill him, because I didn't get the plus 30, but it should do a good amount of damage. Actually, probably as much as the evil snowman with the plus 30 did, I'm pretty sure. A little bit less, okay. And I'm assuming this is the tower shield? Yep. Just beat the tower shield. Right, let's go ahead and knock off that tower shield, then we'll lightning bet, and that should kill Crocotip. Assuming another tower shield is not put on him right here. That would make me very, very upset, though, if that happened. Alright, let's see. We're on those. We'll go ahead and throw the lightning bed. Sweet, it didn't fizzle, so Crocotep is gone. Alright, the rest of this battle should be decently easy. Get that out of here. We'll throw that on just in case we get an evil snowman. Does he tower shield himself though? No, he does not. Okay. Sweet, there's the evil snowman. So let's go ahead and throw on the plus 30 as well. And if I'm right, the unenchanted evil snowman should kill. I'm usually not right though, which is kind of the worrisome part. All right, let's go ahead and throw the evil snowman. Let's see how this does. Didn't kill him, all right. I really need to figure out what my stuff does. We're going to take a slight gamble here, because I'm pretty sure if I fizzle, and I didn't, he would have killed me if he would have used anything powerful. Any, any three pip I spell would have killed me right there, I think. Alright, 
You have found a golden scarab. Let's see. Don't need that or that. And man, I don't think I really need those boots either. Yeah, not really worried about those boots. Go ahead and hit the entrance hall. You have fought bravely. It sickens me to know one of the Order's members gave the Krakonomicon to Queen Krakopatra. Even though it is never easy to defeat one of our own, it was the right thing to do. I fear more troubles await us, young wizard. Krakopatra wields the Krakonomicon, and Krakotep spoke of a new army. The Order has much to discuss. We may not have always acted with wisdom in the past, but you've set us on the right path at last. Come join us in the balance school. All right. Let's go ahead and get to the balance school, and I will be right back. All right, we are at the balance school. Young wizard, you have my eternal gratitude. I heard what you did in the Krakow Sphinx. I feel we are no longer strangers, but comrades in arms. Shalik, General Kaba, Kai Amate, and I all wish to honor you. Please take this golden scarab as a symbol of your entry into the Order of the Fang. No one deserves it more. We will continue to fight the Tuts here, using the wisdom of balance rather than the golden fang. We leave it to you, young wizard, to find and protect the Krakonomicon. You will need to investigate Krakopatra's lair, the Tomb of Storms. Go see Sergeant Major Talbot, for he may be able to help you. Oh, all right. Let's go ahead and get to Sergeant Talbot. Actually, we can just teleport right to the Oasis for that. The Tomb of Storms, eh? Sure you want to go in there? That's quite a dangerous place. The Tut Leader is inside. Well, why didn't you say so? I'll get you in there right away. If you haven't already found a way in. You're in luck. My men are overtaxed, but one of the locals has taken on the Tomb of Storms. I hate doing this to you, but once there, you're on your own. I can't protect the locals and launch an assault. You'll have to be a one wizard army. Ready? Find Hetch Aldeen nearby. He's been working with the summoning stones and will surely know how to get inside. Alright, let's go ahead and see what the new spell I got was. Steel Ward. Okay. I really like that, actually. That all against ice we'll, we'll all take that off the deck for right now. Um, so that's going to be it for me for this episode. Uh, if you enjoyed it, I really appreciate it if you would like and subscribe, and I will see y'all next time.